So, as I continue my black metal journey, I find myself craving the music. And so what happens is I end up on YouTube or I end up on forums and I look for a top 10 list um, and I look for uh, just other people's opinions about what bands are good. And I stumbled across a list of, um, man, I wish I would have recorded the YouTubers uh, channel and then I would have shouted them out. But he did a top 20s vocals, uh, black metal vocals list. And I heard just a snippet of this track that I'm about to listen to. And I was like, wow, I got I to gotta check this out. So I believe this band is called uh, Amez, Amezors. Sounds French. Well, it is French. Because then the song title is, it looks like Hurt. But, or it's pronounced Yurt or something else. I don't know. Help me out in the comment section. Anyway, uh, let's go ahead and check it out. And... Uh, uh, just fully in in indulge in his sound. Let's go. Already, I already feel like these these guys are creating like the feeling of, of sadness and despair. And I've never heard a black metal track with vocals as melodic as this. A lot of times there's growling or there's just a different style of singing, but I've never heard something like this where it's just it's eerie melodic vocals uh, buried under the sound. It's very unique. This is why I love this genre. It's so unique to me. Let's take it back just a little bit. That's crazy. 
That's punk rock in a black metal song. <laughs> oh, man. That is wild. This is a very nice piece right here. I, I really enjoyed this. Um, I, I thought that this band really, really did an excellent job conveying atmosphere and feeling. Um, what I come to find with most black metal songs that I listen to and enjoy, they really just try to try to convey feeling in their music. It's 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 about what it feels like, you know. It's it's like you hear all these different elements and you hear, you know, d drumming and awesome riffs and everything. But overall, it's about what it feels like. And it this song, it felt very dark. And I felt darkness and despair and just, I don't know, it, it just feels really, really cool. Um... But as I said, I, I really enjoyed the vocals in this. This was a unique style for the vocals. I think it gave the song a lot of character. Um, and then I started hearing elements of punk rock. And I went ahead and I pulled up some information about the band in which it says that they combine elements of post-punk and post-rock in their music. And that seemed like that's what happened towards 
the the third half or the later half of the song. Uh, let me see. Yeah. They got into like this post rock kind of sound and completely got out of like the, the black metal sound. So that's the punk rock. There we go. So there's actually it's like three parts in this song. There's three different sounds in this song. You can hear the the you can hear the punk, you can hear the black metal elements, uh, and then you hear the post rock towards the end. And I think they did an excellent job in combining all of those and it, it, all of those sounds in order to make a great song. Uh, so this is this is very cool. This is um this is a band that I'm gonna have to keep on my radar and check out some more music from them. So guys, let me know what you thought about this track. Uh, it's, especially if this is your first time hearing this band. Uh, let me know if you felt me on some of my sentiments and, uh, and uh, you know, leave your thoughts down below in the comment section. Now, if you are a fan of this band and uh, uh, you're familiar with their work, go ahead and put me on to some more music by them. Um, I went ahead and I looked up the, uh, the definition of the title of this song which it means clash in French. So this is a French band. Uh, but anyway, guys, uh, go ahead and subscribe to the channel if you're new here, like this video, and I'll see y'all next time. Peace.